Okay, let's look at the word strong in Descript. So first, as we always cover, as we know, the, the T is usually in this form as the double dash, but it can also have the reverse curve. We usually use it when it's in conjunction with the S, as we can see. T-S looks like in it. Sorry, that's reversed. As you can see, they can connect quite, quite smoothly like that. That version tends to be better. So let's see. The simplest possible combination would be S-T-R-O-N-G. Now, that version I'm not a big fan of. The better version is S T. R O N G. Now we're almost done here actually. This word is extremely simple. So as we can see, the what we can do is we can just start to kind of move that around. So we can go S T R O N G. It's starting to look very nice. Now how do we symbolize strong with this? Now that's that's getting a little difficult. That's very abstract. Um we could try to maybe I don't know draw muscles of some kind, so S T no, we would have to come back for the A. So if we maybe went S, strong. That might start to look like a muscle. Okay, that was a long shot. That really was a long shot. But um, let's just try to draw a nice little square version of the word strong. So if we were working within a box-like shape, cut like a Chinese character, we would have such a space. So I would say the best would be to try to fill the top space rather evenly. And then the NG... Okay, very nice. We don't need the box, actually, to draw that one. That one's very simple and easy to make in a nice square-like shape. Strong.